Welcome back that? to my channel. I'm here with my two favorite people. Hi. Oh, Hi. Yes. <laughs> you somehow didn't <gasps> step on that. <laughs> Literally your feet went like Literally. Clearly I am in New York. Funny story, I had a whole different idea for this week's video. And then I got an invite to a kind of private event for the Jonas Brothers. And at first I was like, okay, this sounds like a really cool thing. But then I didn't know who to go with because no one in my life is a Jonas Brothers fan except for Tess. Except for me. Ding, ding. But then she's like, okay, I cannot go without Carrie and Julia, who has huge fans. So now the four of us are all going. It's like the release of their documentary plus album combined. So I'm learning a lot about the Jonas Brothers. Please do not come for me because I'm not a Jonas Brothers fan. <laughs> I didn't grow up on them, so don't hate me. I like Joe because of Sophie. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> Hello, sunshine. I'm sunshine. Actually, there's a lot of sunshine out there. It's like- Yeah, it's really nice. 14 or 15 C. I think. Is that right there? No, it's like hotter than that. It's like 25. It's like 900 degrees. So we're about to boil in this bitch. <laughs> Look, Dan and Pat are matching. Are you guys best friends or what? We're stripey friends. <laughs> it's exciting because Tess actually just got her wedding invitations in the mail, so we're all just sitting here kind of geeking out over them. Aww. Are you so proud of her? Oh yeah, she's a wizard, man. Are you guys excited to get married? No. Just kidding. <laughs> One of my favorite things about New York coming here at this time are the flowers. No, I think so pretty. So pretty. I was telling Pat that, I was like, oh, I want to take photos in front of all of them. And I'm like, you can't have a decorate your house so pretty and not have people. <laughs> I know. It's cute. Look how cute their apartment is. The AC's on. Sorry, it's kind of loud. Are you wearing a white top too? Oh no, that's a... Like, yeah. Oh, you should wear those. Hey girl. Yeah, tomorrow. Trying for Nick. Wearing white. Oh my god. Um, Are you guys all Nick fans? I'm yeah. so Nick, 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 yeah. Nick, Nick. Sophie Turner. But like second <laughs> Sophie. Like, yeah. Actually before Joe, Joe or Kevin. I don't want to have people like come and like get mad at me for not being the biggest Jonas Brothers fan and going to this event. I'm still extremely grateful that I'm invited and I'm very excited. Yes, Carrie, awesome. Tess, and Julia are huge uh, Jonas Brothers fans, so they're awesome. filling me in on everything. And their excitement is getting me super excited. And why do you keep taking pants on and off? <laughs> I'm trying to my oh, okay. We don't even know what is gonna happen. We got invited to this event, which is like, come, I'll literally read you what it says. So it says the carnival of happiness begins. Spotify invites you to join the Jonas Brothers for an evening of fairground attractions, drinks, dancing, and sugar highs. When and then where? And it says add just TBA. And my manager said that she did like a thing with Spotify for Ariana Grande and Tess went to it too. And they only let you know the um, location like a few hours before so that you don't have like in case people share it and stuff, you know, crazy crowds. It's just more for like security purposes. So that's really exciting. We have no idea where it's going to be, but it sounds like a carnival. So we're trying to dress accordingly, but we don't know if it's inside, outside. It's going to rain tomorrow. So like there's just a lot going on. And I feel like if I was a huge huge fan of somebody in like middle school or high school and then later on in life in my 20s they were doing something I would be freaking out right now so I can totally understand why. Holy for us. Hi! Hi. <laughs> yeah. I had 63 Jonas Brothers photos, posters yeah. in my room. We all bonded over the fact that when we were probably, you know, too I, I had like it. no friends that like loved them the way I, I was did. like 16 and my whole bedroom was covered with just Nick and Jonas Brothers. Yep. Joe was the funny one. <laughs> well, Julia's convinced she's gonna marry Nick. Um, definitely marry Nick. Like, to this he's day. married. The oh. highlight of you finding out when he <laughs> was engaged. Yeah, was it I'm engaged? Lying. She has it. No. When Is it on a highlight? They, they announced high, yeah. uh, his wedding day. Like, his or, like wedding it was day. rumored that like this would be his wedding day, and I fucking hated my life. I was literally sitting in this I'm chair. Your wife. I, I'm your wife. <laughs> like I didn't have you any control over you. my body. <laughs> I don't have a bra on. <laughs> Me either. My boobs jiggle. <laughs> Mine don't. <laughs> I'm processing the fact that my wedding is tomorrow night, so. <laughs> it wow, seems like it's happy, guys. Right? It's starting yes. to I'm ordering my sushi. I, hope so that I think that was the moment we all go look at each other and we're like, this could be something. <laughs> Are you crying? <laughs> Not much has changed, but they lived underwater. Oh and you're great. I look great in my jean, <laughs> your girl has a big vest. I didn't know what the fuck 
makeup one. Oh my god, Julia, can I please insert your photo that you sent to the group? Oh, of course. <laughs> the With the Jonas Brothers t-shirt. Yeah, that literally that. <laughs> With the bangs. Yeah, she was, she was like oh my god. <laughs> it's the smile. I was like, find... do I want to smile? No, I have to find a <laughs> Every like 16 year old at, in that age did, did a smile like, like this. <laughs> yes. It was like, I'm unsure if I want to be happy in this moment. <laughs> it wasn't our smiles. It was the fact that nobody had eyebrows. <laughs> yeah. I fucked every hair. <laughs> Hey guys, uh, we're getting ready to leave. I'm so excited. I think we're getting pumped up by doing our makeup and stuff. Tess is listening to Jonas Brothers. This is the top I'm wearing here. I'm seeing if I could put this somewhere. I don't think you could see this. Um, this top is from, that's, those are my boobs. Um, Reformation. My jewelry is the same as earlier and then I added this one from Medina's Jewelries. Jewelries, jewels. Um, I'm wearing all three of my earrings right now, um, as you can see. Jeans are a gold, and I think I'm gonna add booties. I was actually thinking about it earlier because I couldn't really relate to the whole fangirling when you're younger, but then I thought about it and I was obsessed with Harry Potter from like the ages of, I mean, eight till like now, but the movies came out when I was 11 and I was just obsessed. Like I had posters of the actors on my wall, I loved it. So I can kind of relate that if, let's say today, they had like a Harry Potter event and then the actors were there, I'd freak the fuck out. Like I'd freak out. So I can understand now why they're so excited because literally your childhood is like happening. All your dreams are happening and you get ex invited to this like exclusive secretive event thing. It's just like, it's really, it's fun. So here is a better shot of my outfit. Yay, I just got to Carrie and Julia's. We're getting ready to get in the car. Julia is rapid fire doing her makeup over here. <laughs> Carrie that. rapid fire doing her makeup over there. Tess is cheering them on. I'm wearing white. <laughs> <laughs> Having a pre-show drink. Oh wait, this is really cool. Tess goes flying. Imagine if I fell. That the guy bringing us up to the event said that they're performing at seven and then they're just gonna casually walk around with everyone. So like, <laughs> what? We have 40 minutes to prepare. Are you ready? Honestly, thank no. God, because like makeup still looks good right now. We literally like, slap in and so Should I go to the bathroom now? Or should I go to the bathroom when we get out? So how are y'all feeling right now in this moment? Yep. <laughs> how are you? Breaking out. Tess, how are you? How are you?
pretty excited about it. Just saying. <laughs> to be honest, it is a special night for me. I'm gonna be that guy for a minute. Tell him, tell him, tell This is my daughter's first show I've ever seen this play. The Jonas Brothers. Not even that. Sophie f***ing Turner was with them and they just got in the car in front of us and they just left. <laughs> well, to be fair, their security people were like, it's done. And I was like, but Sophie, I love you. I had Stress. so much fun. Did you best. like your first like real Jonas Brothers experience? Yeah, they were so good. I they know. so good. I know. Me? I won't be able to include like any of the footage. I'll have to chop it up and put different music. So good. So good. Definitely go see them on tour. Yeah. Highly recommend. Hundo people. Whoa. Rude. Okay. <laughs> I'm not okay. I, I miss Sophie Turner. I'm really upset. <laughs> no. Beautiful. First of all, I just want to say thank you so much to these lovely ladies oh, yes. for um, joining me on this trip and literally on teaching me journey. on this journey. <laughs> this journey teaching me journey. so much about what it was like to be in the mindset of a 17 or a 16 year old girl that was obsessed with the Jonas Brothers. I'm just saying, I feel like a little bit like I missed out, but I had oh. so much fun. No, you did not, you got it right now, tonight. I did, and Better I actually had ever. so much fun. Watching them watch the Jonas Brothers was like the highlight. I would go to any concert with you guys, just because of how much fun you guys had. It was so cool. Thank you so much to Spotify for, you know, sending us there. Thank you to Fee from Spotify. Fee. You're the best. <laughs> and thank you to you guys because if it wasn't for you, I Thanks would not be in this situation. Yeah, that was a bad. 
It's, it's okay. That was a bad, a bad thing. She said, this, this is the famous pig. I really don't want to give it to you. You know what? <laughs> You let Julia put it up her nose and you won't even let her touch it. Um, so this is a really nice brush I got from Mophie. Morphe. Mophie. Mophie. Um, an S37. And it says Nick, vote for Nick. Oops. 20. Can you imagine if it's a 2020? I'm like, I'm not fine. Next year. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you are a Jonas Brothers Jonas Brothers. Fan, let me know in the comments who your favorite one is. I feel very blessed to be invited to this and I am just really thankful. Um, we love you guys and yeah. <gasps> <laughs> Snaps for Spotify and the Jonas Brothers. Listen to the new album. Happiness begins at midnight. So bad. If you put that on there, I'm gonna <laughs> if you like, put that I put on there. The I do. <laughs> That was a good one. I want McDonald's, I want a treatment nugget, and I want a McFlurry, and I want it with Nick Jonas. <laughs> yes, and I'm trying to keep them going under. <laughs> you turn the temperature harder. Cause I'm burning up, burning up for you, baby.